everybody, this is AJ the Thunderbolt here, and welcome back to Minecraft Switch Survival Let's Play, or AJ's World. And off camera, I actually did some mining, and I was able to get to full diamond armor, but that was before 1.16 officially released. So, I wish I went mining for netherite instead, but anyways, diamond isn't too bad. But, as some of you guys might remember from the last episode, I accidentally started a raid because I stupidly killed a pillager and then, at the end of the episode, stupidly walked into a village and triggered the raid. So, I'm actually going to go ahead and dump all of my stuff, except for the stuff I might need for the raid, into a chest, into some chests, just that, so that if I die, I won't lose some stuff, so though. I'll take these golden apples just in case I need them. Now, why do I have a bucket of... Oh, yeah, because I'm mining, so... That would go into equipment, I think. And now, where are my tools? Yeah, tools and leopardy. I don't need that stuff. I'm definitely going to need a bow. And these ones would be close to breaking, but I will take these arrows... And then I'm also going to actually need a shield just to protect myself from ravagers. And I'm going to need string. String, string, string. That would be mob loot. I don't know where my stuff is. Oh, yeah, right here. String. And then sticks. Do I have any spare sticks? Yes, I do. So now I can craft a shield and a bow. Let me just put my everything away now. Alright, now I'm all geared up and ready to go. So, I guess I'll take on this raid. If it's still going on, which I'm assuming it is. Yep. Here's the raid. Oh, God. Some villagers may be lost here, but at least there was another village. Oh, wait, no, that village had... Basically, no villagers. Alright, there's a pillager. Let me just kill you. Alright, so it's looking like there's about five, I'd say. Five things I need to kill. So, yeah. I mean, it would feel a little better with enchantment, with enchanted stuff. But I think I used up all of my diamonds to make this armor. I'm pretty sure I'm out. And what are you doing here? I just killed a villager. Is there a bell in this village? What the? Oh, that's loud. That is loud. I did not expect that to be that loud. Actually, no, I should probably conserve my arrows. I don't have infinity. Conserve my arrows just in case they're needed. Alright, and then there's the last pillager, and ooh, emeralds and arrows. Just the things I want. Alright, why am I swimming so slowly? Yes, fire your arrow. And give me those arrows. Okay, now this is the second part of the raid. And let's see what's about to happen with this. Also, you, some of you guys might know, it's been a while. Oh my god. Why is that so loud? Okay, they're over here this time. There's a lot of them. A lot more of them. Oh my god. Alright, keep my shield up. Alright, it should be fine. Okay, there's just two mobs remaining. Alright, and where's the last one? Okay, it's a Vindicator. And a Drown just sitting there. And the Drown doesn't seem to be angry. But is that it for the raid? Nope. I wonder how many rounds there are going to be for this raid. Hopefully there won't be any Ravagers. Because if there would be, that would suck. 
And I think this village actually did have a bell. And I took it. For my own personal use. And, oh, there's a saddled horse there. Wait a minute, is that a horse from back there? How to get over... Okay, anyways. Uh, where are the pillages in? Okay, nope, I can see one right away. Right off the bat. Okay. Let's get on land. Alright. Oh my god, why is that so loud? Minecraft, nerf the volume on that. I'm hoping that, there's, that there won't be any ravagers this whole time. This whole raid. Because if there were, that would suck. But so far, it's looking like I won't need any golden apples. But I'm pretty sure the full diamond armor definitely does help. And, oh, there's one right here. Okay, and where's the last one? If it is Ravager, that's where I'm going to use my bow. Because I do not want to get hit by one of those. Of course it's a Ravager. Dang it. Can you actually ride Ravagers? I, I don't think you can, but... Okay, shield. Hit it. Shield. Hit it. Shield. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Shield. Hit it. Shield. Hit it. Shield. Hit it. And now I just go all in. Okay. The Ravager's gone. And I got an achievement for it. Nice. And hopefully this is the final wave. So this was an unwanted raid. And there's some more of the raid horn or whatever. Where are they coming from this time? Oh, wait. No, there is a bell. Just go ahead and ring that. Panic! Panic! Oh, wait. I'm firing arrows. How many arrows do I actually have? 19. Okay, where are the pillagers and stuff? Where? I'm kind of confused as to where they are. Okay, I think it's that way. Because the sound seems to be coming from that way. Is it this way? Uh. There's... Is that some? No, that's a horse. Oh, no, but there are some. I hit the horse, though. That's not the horse of the saddle, is it? Oh, no, it is. Dang it. Anyways, here's... There's some hay. Let me actually take out the witch from a distance. Oh, stop healing. Alright, the witch is gone. So there are probably going to be about six mobs, I'd say. Six or five. And the sun's setting. Okay, this is going to start getting a little bit worrying. That's because the sun is setting. Oh, it keeps going from behind me. You're dead. Let me actually eat some of my bread. Okay, where are you coming from? All right, you're dead. Two more mobs remaining, and hopefully that will be the end of it. I am hoping that it will be. And if it's not, well, then that's just going to be annoying. But where are the final two mobs? Actually, going into a village, there's a house, and using a bed might not be a bad idea. But, oh, there's a witch there. I'm assuming that witch is going to be part of the raid, that those witches are. If they're not, well, then the... The mobs won't decrease. Don't poison me. Don't poison me. Don't poison me. Don't poison me. Alright. And then the witch over here is probably part of the raid. And please be the final wave. And there's a horse with golden horse armor. I don't think that's my horse. Oh, wait. No, they are. And the horse is... Okay, no. That was just a regular witch. But these horses are mine. I think it has slowness or something. Yeah, but how'd they get over to the village? 
Oh my god! Why is it so loud? Uh, dismount. Where's the last one? I really don't know. But actually, does it have a bed? Yes, it does. So I can just sleep, change it today. And that's all good. But anyways, where is the last one? Is it an Illager or a Ravager? Oh, it's that witch. Stop blowing your horn. Stop healing. Okay, I think I'm out of arrows, actually. And is that it for the raid? Nope. Oh, wait. Okay, I, I have one arrow that I just fired. All right, can I pick this arrow up? Okay, that's two arrows. Any more arrows just laying around? No, it doesn't seem like it. Oh, God. Stop blowing the horn. Hopefully this is the final wave. There are five, wait, how many are there in total? No, I just realized this is my first raid in survival mode. Just saying, in this, in this world and Hivecraft Season Zero, which are going to sometimes still happen, I am learning a lot of new stuff about Minecraft. Since normally in survival worlds, I don't get much further than getting a diamond pickaxe or getting diamonds. But anyways, where are they? I, it was louder over here. And I'm super confused. Oh, no, okay, there's one in the water over there. I actually just eat this bread to regen. And there's a Ravager. Give me a little Vindicator. You're not going to give me arrows, are you? Okay, and there's a Ravager coming. Oh, and I'm lagging. Gotta love lag. Am I right? Okay, there's a Ravager up there, but it doesn't look like it's just gonna walk off. So, if I just come up here... The, oh my god, this is a villager, or no, an illager, or a pillager, walking around here on a Ravager, riding on a Ravager. Get rid of... Okay, nope, never mind, I can't get rid of the guy on top. I need them to come out of the water just so I can use my shield to safely get rid of the Ravager. Because my bow broke. Oh, hey. No, that's hitting the Ravager. Okay, I'm in the water now. I need to get out of here before the Ravager hits me. Because you know they do a lot. They may not do as much because of the, my diamond armor. Alright, that one's dead. And the Ravager's dead. Alright. Now, the rest are up here. And do I have any more arrows still? Nope, I'm fresh out of arrows. Come here. Alright, you're dead. And I'm lagging. Again. You're dead. Who else is gonna die? Uh, you're gonna die. You're dead. Two more mobs remaining. Isn't there, like, a oh, final wave of, like, ten mobs? Or is that just in, like, hard mode? I don't know. Okay, but there's an evoker. Alright, so if I just, like, casually... Oh, no. Oh, and now there's vexes. Stop running away. Yes, I know you do magic from range. Alright, okay. There's a ravager left. I'm glad I saw that before it saw me. Or no, it saw me and it was coming towards me, but I glad I saw Oh no, that this does nothing. You do one heart of damage. Yeah, you do nothing with diamond armor. And I have the hero of the village. Alright. Now, which oh god. There's a librarian though. Will the librarian have mending? Let's see. Where are they? I hate vexes. I'm just gonna leave them there. Uh oh, nope, got one. Got the other. Now this last one. I guess it can just lead there. Unless it continues to come closer. If it like follows me around. Then I am going to have to get rid of it. But you. You're a librarian. Do you have mending? It does have an enchanted book. 
And the enchanted buff is quick charge. Oh, and I got flame, infinity. Infinity! Yes, I can get an infinity bow. So, infinity is going to be the most useful thing from the enchanted book that I have right here. And, uh, this is all the loot that I got. So, a pretty decent amount. And I'm definitely going to have to find another villager and make a villager breeder. Because, are you the only villager I left alive? Left in this village? Hopefully not. But if it is the only villager left, well then, I'm going to have to go find a new village somewhere. Alright, so there's one of my horses. Why did you wander like this far away? Do I have leashes? I don't think I do. But I can definitely have fences. And anybody here? By the way, when does the hero of the village effect end? Okay, but it looks like this village, the villagers all died or something. Wasn't there a lot of villagers here at first? Or at least a couple? I don't exactly remember. But it looks like I am going to have to venture out into the world further. There's, yeah, and there's a chest I looted. Although, it's looking like that librarian is the only villager here. No other villagers here besides a librarian. So, I mean, I can turn that librarian into basically anything I want. Or give, to give me all the books that I want. Like mending, or like, um, it's another good one. Oh, no, there's, there's a village nitwit. Can village nitwits breed with other villagers to get more villagers? Hopefully they can. So there are other villagers here. That's a good sign. And this horse is slow. Alright. And you know what? I think since you've wandered all the way over here, I'm not sure that you really want to be in my possession. And I'm going to let you go. Run free, horse. And what about the other horse? Is the other horse fast? And is the other horse fast? Wait, where is the other horse? Eh, whatever. Who cares? I'll come for the horse eventually. Unless it just completely wanders away. Another thing that I'm going to definitely need would be sugarcane. So, how much sugarcane do I actually have? have and how full okay i'm gonna have to get rid of a few stuff here but i should probably harvest my garden my little garden that i built in the last episode didn't harvest that one and look at that the sun's setting I'm going to prioritize carrots here, just because I can turn them into golden carrots. And also I have nine, oh wait, no, never mind. I don't, I have 14 seeds, which is plenty of seeds for planting 10, a 10 by, t a 10 by 2 garden. That's what I was trying to say. I'm going to turn this wheat into bread and then just put my carrots in extra food, just in case I need them. So, this is how you bake in Minecraft. You just use a crafting table. It's weird. Okay, now that my inventory's all cleared, I'm going to go ahead and sleep. And now to go find some sugar cane. Oh my god, look at, look, there's a chain of four zombies. Yes, follow me. I'm faster than you. And you will die. Do I actually... Wait, before I go out looking for sugar cane... Do I... Hey, you can't be my infinite water source. No. Yeah, there you go. Do I have any sugar cane... 
Uh, let's see. Would I put it in food stuff if I had some? Oh, nope. I have a good amount of sugar cane. But I'm also going to need leather. Let me just go ahead and plant a lot of the sugar cane with buckets. So I'm thinking just making rows of sugar cane or something like that. Maybe like up here. I can just have... I'll have this by 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, 7, 8 there. Then over here. This is 8. And then let me just fill that up. And do one more wa row of water. And now... Oh yeah, I need to fill it with water. Right. That would be useful. And I forgot to fill these buckets up. So then that one's full of water. This one's full of water. Oh, yeah, and they'll all flow to here. Actually, they can all flow into just here. Or I can just stand here and then collect it. I mean, I could just easily make a collection system. But I don't feel like it. Also, I'm running low on time. So I just need two more water buckets. And then I can plant the sugar cane. It's right there. And, oh no. Oh wait, nope, nope, nope. That, that doesn't work. Nope. Does it flow, will it flow down here? Nope, never mind. I don't understand how water flows in this game. Anyways, let me just plant all of this sugar cane. Just so I can have more sugar cane. For enchanting. Because I'm not going to enchant until I get the 15 bookshelves, probably. Alright, and I have, I have four sugar cane remaining. But anyways, anyways, you guys, that is going to wrap up this video. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to let me know with a like and subscribe to my channel if you're new with notifications on so you never miss an upload. Also, feel free to share this video with a friend who either likes Minecraft content or you think you'll just like my channel in general. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.